What's up YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, I've got six different ways on how to rock a hoodie. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern, discussing various men's lifestyle topics, such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe, tap that notification bell, and join us. And to my returning friends, like Tato Vargas is Aguirre, salute. Now we all love rocking hoodies. I mean, they're no brainers. They're comfortable, they're warm. But I'm here to suggest to you today, they're also versatile. You can wear a hoodie in a wide range of situations. And I'm gonna prove that to you today. In today's video, I've got six different looks from rugged to casual to smooth. Gonna show you how to rock the hoodie on its own or as a layering option. Gonna show you a couple different hoodies in a bunch of different situations. So without any further delay, let's get into this lookbook on how you can rock a hoodie six different ways. Now for our first look, we're going the rugged route with a little bit of a 90s feel. As in this look, I rock a hoodie with some Tim's. That's right, I broke out my boot favorite, my butters as we call them in Philly. And one of the things I really love about this look, the combination of navy and olive or navy and green in any combination is one of my favorites. And like we might have done back in the 90s, rocking a hoodie with a pair of cargoes. Except for back then, they might have been real baggy. We'll bring them to the modern age with a nice slim fit pair of olive cargoes, the 484s from J. Crew. So when you need a look that's rugged, masculine, but still put together, throw on that hoodie, a pair of cargoes, and those tins. Now when it comes to building an outfit around that hoodie, it pays to have the right one. One that's heavy enough to keep you warm, but light enough to layer under your jacket. And we just so happen to have the perfect hoodie from today's video sponsor, Essentials, who not only sponsored the video, but provided both of the great hoodies you'll see me rocking throughout the lookbook. Now, of course, you guys have heard me brag and talk about Essentials, especially the t-shirt, many, many times. But I'm telling you this time, Jose and the boys have outdone themselves. They've added new pieces. They've upped the construction, refined the details, and this launch is special. Which launch? I'm talking about the launch this Saturday, April 27th at 10 a.m. Now listen to me, even though I work with Jose and the guys, I have to register early to get dibs on new stuff. That's how fast it sells out. And when you go over to essentials.co, register for the newsletter, you get first dibs on the launch before anybody else. Either way, make sure you're ready for the launch on April 27th. I'm telling you, they've really done it this time. They've got the t-shirts. They got the hoodies I'm showing you today. Long sleeve t-shirts, Henley, joggers. I mean, they've got every essential a guy needs for a well-rounded, stylish wardrobe. I mean, the proof is in the pudding. Look at the hoodies I'll be rocking throughout the lookbook today. I mean, I can layer them very easily. They're warm and they have a bit of a tailored fit. I mean, they're just a perfect fit. I absolutely love them. I thought I loved the t-shirts. I think I love the hoodies just as much. But I'm telling you, take heed to what I'm saying. You know Essentials launches, they sell out quick, sometimes in a matter of days. So make sure you get over there to Essentials.co, sign up for the newsletter, so you get first dibs for the launch April 27th at 10 a.m. Eastern. Now for our second look of the day, we're leaving rugged behind, and this time we're going smooth. And I'm guarantee you're gonna be asking me a question. Jeff, I know you're not rocking a hoodie with some tassel loafers. Well, actually, yes, my brother, I am. This time I switched out the Navy Essentials hoodie and put on a sand one. And yes, with my black tassel loafers. Now what I love about this look, it's a great layering look. It's cool, it's smooth. You see I have my dark denim jacket over the hoodie, matched it with some nice slim fit burgundy chinos, and finish it off with my black tassel loafers. I'm talking about this is a look you actually can rock on a date. I'd have no problem rocking a hoodie with a nice young lady with this look. Once again, showing you the versatility of the hoodie. It can be rugged, but it also can be smooth. We started off with rugged, took it to smooth. Now for our third look, let's do a look with some edge. As this time we switch back to the navy hoodie and rock it under a leather biker jacket. Now this is absolutely one of my favorite looks to layer a hoodie with. Super warm, but still cool and that black in the navy just hits. And of course, playing off the navy in the hoodie, I threw on a pair of nice medium wash jeans. And to keep the cool look going, I finished it off with, you guys know my favorite pair of sneakers, 
by Air Jordan 1 Breads. The black in the sneakers playing off the black in the leather jacket. Showing you can throw on a hoodie, not look sloppy, actually have a little masculine edge with it by throwing it on under your favorite leather jacket. And for our fourth look of the day, I've got another cool relaxed look. But this one for the temperature is a little warmer when you don't want to do a layer. This time again, we're switching out the navy, going back to the sand essentials hoodie, but this time doing it on its own with a pair of jeans and one of my favorite boots to rock, my sand colored suede Chelsea boots. Now this is another look I would wear on a casual date. Instead of throwing on some sneakers, I'm giving this look a little sex appeal with the Chelsea boots. And it's an easy combination to make as I like the distressed jean look with the sand color on top. Once again, showing you just how versatile the hoodie can be, if it fits you well, throw on a pair of Chelsea boots, you got a sexy look, yes, with a hoodie. Now for our fifth look of the day, we're stepping up the dressiness question. Yes, we're taking a hoodie upscale, as this time we switch back to the navy hoodie and rock it under a suit. Now this look I love. With people wearing suits less and less, I like to throw on a look that dresses the suit down a little bit. Forget the shirt and tie sometimes. And of course, with the hoodie being more of an athletic piece, why not match it up with a nice minimal pair of sneakers? In this case, my white Adidas Continental 80s. Nice minimal sneaker, the best way to go when you're doing the suit and sneaker look. I love how the hit of the navy in these Adidas Continentals plays off the navy in the hoodie. You say you don't like the rock suits, they're not that versatile. Combine the versatility of the hoodie with the suit, dress down. It's a go-to look. And last but certainly not least on our lookbook on how to rock a hoodie six different ways, we're going back to a little bit more relaxed athletic look as we switch back to the sand hoodie and pair it with a pair of running sneakers. Really love the way this sand hoodie goes very well with these prontos from Greats because of hits of sand in the sneakers. And one of the keys about this look, although you do have the sneakers and the hoodie on, a slim fit pair of chinos refines the look just a bit. This is a great weekend look. I mean, a hoodie was made for weekends, but I wouldn't have a problem wearing this out to the mall, casual looks, maybe to a movie. When you have a hoodie that fits this well and you're pairing it off with other great pieces, such as the sand in these sneakers and a nice pair of slim fit chinos, you've got a great relaxed, but cool, casual look. Okay, so there you have it. My lookbook on how to rock that hoodie, six different ways. Make sure you let me know in the comment section what your favorite look was. Once again, I want to thank today's video sponsor, Essential. Make sure you head over to Essentials.co, sign up for that newsletter so you can be ready for this Saturday's launch at 10 a.m. Eastern. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button. Helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos we release every day at 4 p.m. Eastern. And I'll check you out tomorrow.